Our next story is about the moon, the Earth's closest celestial neighbor. Turns out it's not as stable and solid as we think. According to a new study, the moon has been shrinking in size over the past 100 million years. And due to this, the celestial body is witnessing unprecedented moon quakes. The study in question has been conducted by scientists from NASA. It was published in the Planetary Science Journal on the 25th of January. Let me now take you through the key findings of that study. It says that the moon has shrunk over 150 feet in its circumference. The core of the moon has gradually cooled during the same period. The continuation of the shrinking process is leading to frequent moonquakes. These moonquakes could affect the landing sites of future lunar missions. But how and why is this shrinking even happening? And to understand that, we will first have to know a little bit about the composition of the moon itself. To start with, the moon is made up of several layers, just like an onion. The outermost layer is called the crust. It's about 50 kilometers thick. Beneath the crust is the mantle, which is about 1,000 kilometers thick. And right in the center of the moon is the core. And this layer is about 600 kilometers in radius. The core is made up of two parts, an inner core, which is solid, an outer core which is liquid. The moon's source of heat is the core. The heat is generated by radioactive decay from, from the formation of the moon. However, over time, the core has been losing heat and cooling down. And as it cools down, it shrinks in size. And this basically creates a mismatch between the core and the mantle. The mismatch puts stress on the crust, which bends and breaks, forming faults. And these faults are not static, but dynamic. They can slip and move, causing the surface of the moon to quake. These quakes are called moon quakes. The scientists behind the study used data from the Lunar Reconnaissance Orbiter to observe the shrinking moon. The orbiter can take high-resolution images of the lunar surface, revealing the features and the details of the faults. And what did the images reveal, you ask? Well, the show, they showed that the moon has shrunk by 150 feet in circumference over the past few hundred million years, as the core cooled by about 300 degrees Celsius. And what does the moon's shrinking even mean? Well, it has implications for the future of lunar exploration and colonization. The moon quakes caused by the faults could pose a threat to the safety and stability of any structures or equipment that human beings may build or deploy on the moon, especially in the south polar region, which is a potential landing site. It is prone to strong and shallow moon quakes that could damage the spacecraft or even hurt the astronauts. And lastly, the shrinking of the moon reveals the dynamic and evolving nature of the natural satellite. It shows how the moon is not a dead and inert rock, but a living and active world in itself. And this shrinking can help us understand the history and future of the moon, as well as the history and future of the Earth-Moon system. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the updates on the move.